Welcome back to my Good, the Bad, and the Ugly recap video of Vladoff Snipers. This video, I've got the long nail and the machine. Uh, the long nail is parts dependent, so or parts locked, so it just is what it is. The machine here, although it doesn't show prefixes, has a damage prefix on it. Because with its already ridiculous fire rate, you're just better off getting more out of that damage. Uh, I also brought it in shock. So I'm going to start off with a long nail here. Since there's only two guns, I'll bring this to the first two areas and uh, see if I can hit an enemy. Where are you? But you can see as it's supposed to, it just goes right through their shields. And that's why it's nice and fire. Uh, I've uh, kind of not bashed, but uh, you know, said that some fire guns are limited because the shields got such a buff in this game, and that makes this pretty good. Well, I'm not really used to using flat off snipers, so. Uh, I'm going to miss a few shots here. But uh, it shouldn't be too bad of a, big of a deal because uh, Jack doesn't care. Ammo wise. And this guy's going to be really weak on, so I'm just going to chuck grenades at him. And eat him up that way. Same thing with this guy, because uh, this thing has lowered base damage and is fire only, so it's just not going to do anything to those suits. But the Quasars will. And where is this guy? Where are you? So uh, that actually went a little, quite a bit slower than the Magna did in the previous one. But uh, part of that too is I'm just more used to using Maliwan Sniders and aiming and shooting with those and managing the recoil with them. Whoops, did not mean to do a screensaver there. Sorry. I almost tried to throw Scorn there. I just, I had my finger on the melee button. I hit a toss scorn before I uh, hit the mob. Doing all those Maya videos and these sometimes confuses me, I guess. I also miss scorn. Alright. So I'm also going to do these, uh, this little area. Well, this area and that one right ahead. So they both died. An ultimate badass. Where's his head? He's doing his uh, shake around thing. I should know that the dots don't go through. The dots are still hitting the shields. No, I should hurry along since I have them out to this area before I start uh, losing it. Yeah, there you can see I'm just not quite as uh, used to aiming these. But uh, with someone like him, it does eat through the badasses pretty quick. Now, if I wasn't playing Jack, I'd probably already be out of ammo. Alright, and that's them. So the long nail uh, performed pretty well. But there is part of me that almost just prefers a droop to this and just have it in shock and just beat them down because uh, the lowered base damage of it. But then again, you do to get the match elements. So we kind of uh, will be able to see that with the machine here. 
I will fill up on ammo, even though I don't need much, because AA. <laughs> yeah, one thing. That's pretty awesome. Alright, my jack should be back pretty soon here, which is all good news. You can see this one just uh, breaks their shield so fast. And when it speeds up like that when you need it, it's uh, pretty awesome. I actually like that it kind of starts slower, honestly, because then as a sniper it's easier to uh, kind of place that one shot. And then uh, on the big baddies, when you really need that uh, fire rate, you can get it. But on the normal enemy, you don't really need it, and you can just take them out. And this guy can... that kill him? Yep. So you can see that. On the big guys, when you need that DPS, you have it. And if you want to use it more of a traditional just one-shot sniper, you can. So yeah, this thing... I think it's definitely one of the best snipers in the game. I thought he was already dead. Is that it? Did I finish it? Yes. So, you see there, that was pretty fast. Usually my action skill ends for at least the last couple guys, uh, but I kept it the whole way. So this thing is... Properly titled as the machine, it is ridiculously powerful. But uh, you can use it kind of as both burst DPS with just that single shot because it does have a uh, some pretty solid base damage. Or you can uh, hold it down like I did on that power suit and use it as more of that DPS machine on those bosses. Kind of works both ways. So I really like the mechanics of this gun. I would, uh, God, it's, hey, not crappy loot. this and the Skull Masher are probably the best two snipers in the game, but, uh, this would, this might be the best. I don't know. It, it's hard to compete with this, especially with the way the damage increase works. This thing can just, uh, pump out a ridiculous amount of fire rate, and with that natural 38 magazine... You can really get this magazine up huge. Um, Jack's got you know that skill I don't have it specced into on this build, where when you chuck grenades you get a bigger magazine size by a lot. Uh, I mean every character's got some kind of magazine increase. Uh, Athena has Gav no GT. I forgot the name of it for the second, but she's kind of got a it's like Maya's foresight. I want to say Gathering Tempest, but that doesn't sound right. Um, you know, Wilhelm's got a bunch of... Ma he's got magazine stuff. They they all do. And with this thing's continuous fire thing and such a big magazine, it's just no real big enemy stands a chance. It comes in all elements, and you can pretty much just shred anything with this. So you just have to be careful about the ammo. You know, Nisha in particular struggles with ammo because she cranks fire rate up so high. But, uh, you know, that's first world problems. So, let me know what you guys think of these guns and Vladoff snipers, or I guess snipers as a whole in this game, uh, in the comments, and we'll have a chat about that. And I will see you guys later moving on to another type of gun. I'm not sure what I'm doing next. I think I'm saving assault rifles for almost last. I'll do launchers after them, because, uh... Uh, what is it? Those crybaby guns. The Binding of Isaac one. I name escapes me, but the, there's so much to those. I kind of want to hold off to do those till the end. So maybe I'll do pistols next. Maybe that's all that's left. I might have to do them next. So you guys have that to look forward to, and I will see you later. Thanks for watching and sticking through this series. I appreciate it, and I will see you all later. Bye.